Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are doing great. So let's see today's problem. Problem is maximum odd binary number. Very very easy problem. So let's see the problem. Problem is that we are given a binary string that contains at least one. You have to rearrange the bits in such a way that the resulting binary number is the maximum odd binary number that can be created from this combination. Re return a string representing the maximum odd binary number that can be created from the given combination. Note that the resulting string can have leading zero. Okay, so a binary string is given to us. What we have to do is we have to create the maximum odd number which we can make. Maximum odd number. So if you see this is even number, we have to create an odd number and we have created an odd number which can be made from this numbers which is 1. So let's see uh, this in test case 0, 0, 1. Okay. Uh, sorry, this is not the test case. We have the test case as 0, 1, 0. So in the problem we are given that we have a string which has at least 1. There will be always at least 1. We just have to take this care of this statement at least one okay now uh, you have to rearrange the bits in such a way that the resulting is maximum odd binary number so this number should be rearranged rearranged such that it makes the big maximum odd number okay now guys just one question i have for you one question if you have this number and if you have this number how can you identify just looking at one bit that if this is odd or this is even or this is odd or this is even just looking at one bit so i hope you uh, i hope you guessed it by looking at the last bit right we can tell ki whether it is an even number or it is an odd number because for even numbers this bit will always be 0. For odd numbers, this bit will always be 1. Because odd numbers are like, if you see the binary representation, like if you have this 1, 1, 0, 0, so this will be 2 raised, so 0, 1, 2, 3. So it will be something like 2 raised to power 3 plus 2 raised to power 2 plus 2 raised to power 1 plus 2 raised to power 0. Okay, so basically 2 into 1. So here we have 2 into 0. So I hope you understood like how we create the binary number. Uh, we have we have to multiply it. Okay. Uh, so I hope you understood that. Like basically 1 into like that. 1 into 1 into 1 into like that. Okay. So uh, now for even numbers we should have 0 here. For odd numbers we should have 1. So first of all when you have this number you will see that okay this is zero so we have to make an odd number so if we have to make an odd number this last bit should be one right this last bit should be one this is one thing i hope you have understood this point now let's see this test case we have zero one zero one zero one zero one so see this has already one at the end meaning this is an odd number but if we have to make maximum odd number what can we do what can we do we see in if we go if we have more ones on the left side obviously number will become greater right okay so this one and be shifted here so if we swap these two something like this number will become so what i have done i have swapped these two so this number was what this number was 2 raised to power 3 into 0 plus 2 raised to power 2 into this one plus 2 raised to power uh, 1 into 0 plus 2 raised to power 0 into this one so this number is 4 plus 2 uh, sorry no, 4 plus 1 which is 5 okay now this number which is which has become is what 2 raised to power 3 into 1 plus this will be 0 plus 0 plus 2 raised to power uh, 0 into 1 which is uh, 8 plus 1 which is 9. 
right so we have created this is a maximum odd number which can be made from this okay so if you see the output 1001 is the output so how can we make that how can we make that so let's say guys what we can do is we want all the ones in the left side and all the zeros on the right side so that we become it becomes a bigger number because if more ones are here obviously it will increase the value right like this 2 raised to power power will increase right so what i will do i will shift all the ones to left all the right zeros to the right so that number becomes greater but now you will say me ki ayushi like odd number should have one at the last bit right one at the last bit so that is very simple no so what will i do we have 0 1 0 1 first of all i will sort it in descending order so this will become 1 1 0 0 0 now this is an even number i need to make it odd so what i will do i will just simply pick out the last one which i can have and will swap it with the first bit so one this zero will come here zero and this one will go here one so this will become my odd number which can be the which is maximum let's take another example let's take another example so let's take this example we have 1 0 0 0 1 0 1 okay we have to find the maximum odd number i will do what i will just simply bring all the ones so i will just sort it so there are 1 2 3 ones then there are four zeros those but this is even number since zero is at the last bit i will just iterate from this direction i will find out the first one which i encounter and i will just swap it with the last bit okay so this will become 1 1 0 0 this zero will come here then 0 0 0 and this one will come here so this is my odd number maximum odd number i hope you understood this approach basically i am just creating the largest number largest odd number so first step in this is to uh, sort the string descending order okay then iterate from the right iterate from right right like from here and find out the first one find out first one and then swap it fourth step is to swap it with the zeroth bit oh sorry swap it with the zeroth bit that is the last bit which is in the in, in the string which is the last bit just swap it with that one so this is one approach obviously what will be the time complexity we are sorting so it will be n log n and space will be constant no extra space okay if you see the code for this basically we sorted okay and then what we are doing is uh, we find from we iterate from the right and we check if we get one if we got one we just swap it okay we just swap it so i hope you understood this is approach now there is one more approach which will solve this problem in o of n time okay now let's see that so let's take this test case only we have 1001001 okay so guys see what we have understood is that all ones should come in the starting then all zeros and at last there should be one 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 right so simple i will find out how many ones are there there are three ones how many zeros are there what i will do i will find out how many zeros are there there are four zeros so 
since one one needs to go at the first bit zeroth bit so how many like we have three ones i will first put n so let's say this is n i will first put n minus 1 ones in the starting then i will put all the zeros four zeros and then the last one bit one for the last bit so this will give me my maximum odd number so i hope you understood this approach as well let's see the code so first of all i have counted how many ones are there and how many zeros are there in the string then we just created a new string which is concatenating total counts of 1 minus 1 initially then all the zeros and at last the one i hope you understood this problem and the approach this is o of n time uh and let me know in the comments if you have any problem if you found the video helpful please like it share with your friends i hope you and we'll see you in the next video thank you